Ongoing community health concerns led to a suspension of all public and private events at the Frauenthal Center through the end of the year. 13 on your side, Lakeshore reporter John Mills has more now on what that will mean in Muskegon's downtown. The Frauenthal Center has been closed to the public since March. The theater stage is silent, muted by COVID-19. This is a very difficult time for theaters everywhere, and the Frauenthal is no exception. First, public performances were postponed. Now all performances are suspended through the end of the year, and private events like weddings at the theater won't happen either. We had about 13 from October to December scheduled. The theater's executive director says that decision, difficult, but the right one to protect the safety and well-being being of patrons, volunteers, staff and entertainers. And this stage is busy. West Michigan Symphony, Muskegon Civic Theater, Muskegon Community College's Downtown Live Concert Series, the Buster Keaton Film Festival. The theater is a big draw on Western Avenue. So they're coming to have dinner and a show and then maybe a drink or dessert afterwards. Jason Bertoya with the Muskegon Civic Theater had to push the first three shows of his season into next season. The Civic hopes smaller black box performances can begin in January. We're keeping our Fingers crossed right now. And the Civic is busy planning Fire Pit Follies, a traveling show. Which are driveway or backyard or front yard performances. The saying goes, the show must go on. But when? That's the question everyone keeps asking. And I know a lot of people, including us, are looking forward to when we're able to gather in person again. And Frauenthal Center leaders are already looking ahead to 2021, while at the same time looking for creative ways to recognize the theater's 90th anniversary sometime this fall. In Muskegon, John Mills, 39 on your side.